Welcome back to In Photoshop 1. While working in 3D in Photoshop, there are many different ways and programs to create a 3D model. One of the programs you could use is Rhino. Rhino is a free open source program. To get this program, visit rhino3d.com and click the download tab. I will also include a link in the description. After downloading, open up your program. Now begin creating your model. If you have never used Rhino before, I have several tutorials uploaded that I will link at the end of this video, and I'm always uploading more. Once you have finished your model, export it as an OBJ file. Now open up Photoshop. I will need to turn on the use of my graphics processor. I will do this by going to the top menu and selecting Photoshop, Preferences, Performance. In this window, I will check the box labeled Use Graphics Processor. I will then click 3D and check to make sure I am using all of the VRAM available. This will speed up my 3D functionality. I will create a new document. To place your 3D model, go to the top menu and select 3D, New 3D Layer from File. Select your OBJ file. We will click OK in the next window and yes in the third to enter the 3D workspace. We have successfully placed our model. You can rotate it as you wish, change the environment, and select different materials. To create an exploded view of your model, you could gumball each component outwards. For additional information about the 3D workspace in Photoshop, please visit the following links. If you are learning Rhino for the first time, please visit the following links. Thanks for watching. Please feel free to like and share this video. Check out my other videos and subscribe.